Hello friends, my name is Viraj. Today I would like to show how to create a store procedure and various type of functionality such as insert, update, delete using store procedure. So let us begin with our tutorial. So first click on your SQL Server Management Studio. Just enter your login and password. And simply connect it. Now click on new query and start create your the first step will be create a database. So write create database YouTube. Just select and execute it. After that we will create table table that will be viewers the first parameter will be v name that is big in begin not null primary key v name that is where care fifty Another parameter fifty with null. Another parameters will be v location. Where care fifty null just simply copy it. Paste here. And last parameter that is V gender where care fifty null just simply select execute it. So your table is created. Now we will create our store procedure. So write create procedure name procedure name will be view count view count then write at the red v id that is your first column name that is v id v id in is equal to null comma then at the red v name that is where care fifty is equal to null at the rate v location where care fifty is equal to null then v gender where care 50 is equal to null then 
here you will not give any semicolon then write as begin as begin and inside that write set no count no count on semicolon here our first functionality will be insert a new record so write dash that new or you can give a name that is insert insert new record or we have forgotten taken one more parameter that is at the rate status that will be a where care 50 is equal to null so whatever the functionality such as insert update delete or select will be done on this parameter means this parameter catch all the functionalities after that write if if at the rate status is equal to single inverted inside that write insert then begin and inside that right insert into viewers open a bracket right vid comma v name comma v location comma v gender and your values open a bracket and close it just simply copy this paste here just write at the rate in the front of each and every parameter So your, your insert functionality is completed after that our next functionality will be select record in table select record in table if at the rate status is equal to single inverted that is select then begin begin and Decide that right 
select V ID, V name, V location, V gender. From viewers. So you are select functionality is completed. Then your next functionality will be update record in table. Update record in table if at the rate status is equal to inverted commas single inverted commas that is update begin and inside that write update viewers set v name is equal to at the rate v name V location is equal to at the rate V location comma V gender is equal to at the rate V gender where V ID is equal to at the rate V ID Now your update functionality is completed. The next functionality will be deleting record from table. That is delete record from table. If at the rate status is equal to single inverted delete then begin and inside that write delete from viewers where vid is equal to at the rate vid set no count of first you have created and set uh, no count on and the end set no count off no semicolon just select this procedure and execute it command completed successfully so in this way you can create your store procedure where your all the functionalities such as insert, update, delete, select can be used to show various kind of data where you want to insert a data using store procedure. If you want to update uh, the data using store procedure, you want to show the uh, data, then you can use your select. Uh, functionality if you want to delete some record you can easily delete it by using uh, the functionality delete 
uh, where the your value is a catch in status so hope you like this video please like subscribe share it and keep supporting me bye